again with K-Square Fitness. Today I'm going to break it down the strict ring pull-up. Alright guys, so keep going to performance here as we get into another pull-up variation. Today it will be on the rings. Same mechanics apply on all things that we do when we're pulling, and that's creating a hollow body shape first, whether that's on the bar, hollow body when you're out in front, glutes are tight, ribs are down, you got a good shape. Same thing applies on the rings. Uh, if you're doing it on high rings, excellent. I don't have high rings, so I'm gonna still try to create that shape as much as I can. So it'll be a little bit more out in front versus if you had high rings, they would just be down, uh, point to the ground. So other than that, you're gonna start from the bottom. Toes are out in front, arms are locked out, and when you pull, we're actually gonna rotate the palms in this way. The big thing that I wanna see is every time that you are finishing in this locked out position, just about where your arms are behind your ears, not cutting it short, being, doing your pull up back here. Push your head through every rep. Turn the rings towards you. Head through. And then pull from there. If you're trying to get better doing muscle ups, one thing that you can add that to is training it with a false grip. So that's where you got that big grip on top of the rings, placing it right through here. And you can train false grip ring pull ups. And that one, You'll keep your rings neutral so whenever you go for a turnover when you do muscle up. That's the straight ring pull up. Get after it.